Hey guys, this is Brother Matt, Senior Pastor at New Liberty Baptist Church. And I have a question for you. Have you ever wondered about the number 40? And no, I don't mean about being over the hill. I'm talking about what does the number 40 mean? Well, throughout the Bible, the number 40 designates some important periods of time. For example, God caused it to rain for 40 days, destroying everything on the earth except for Noah and his family. Moses led the Israelites for 40 years in the desert. And that entire 40 years, manna rained down. Moses met with God on Mount Sinai for 40 days, and he received the law. The prophet Elijah walked for 40 days and nights to reach the mountain of God. Ezekiel laid on his side for 40 days to bear the iniquities of Judea. Goliath taunted Israel for 40 days before David finally defeated him. Jonah warned Nineveh that 40 days more, and then you'll be destroyed. In the New Testament, we see where Jesus fasted for 40 days. And then after his resurrection, he was with his disciples for 40 days before he ascended to heaven. You see, 40 is a number that signifies testing and trials and triumph. It also signifies new life and transformation and change. In other words, it designates a period of time to complete an important spiritual challenge or journey. Often that challenge involves repentance from sin and strengthening one's faith. At other times, the spiritual challenge involves overcoming temptation or having an important meeting with God. It can even be a challenge to believe the good news of the gospel and to share one's faith. Yet 40 is also a number connected to the fulfillment of God's promises. And there is no better promise than the hope we have in the triumphal resurrection of Jesus Christ that we celebrate every Easter. So this Easter, why not join us on an amazing 40-day journey to the cross, to the tomb, to the resurrection? I promise you will be blessed.